Alright, still the 30th. See these oil puddles on this piece of cardboard, which is covering oil puddles on my floor. There's a stump jumper. There's a blaze. I'm doing one of my least favorite jobs in the world, which is changing the lower seal on a gearbox on a bush hog. Being that I am thrifty, do it myself. I don't have a lie handy, but it's pretty cut and dry. You take off your blades, and the fun part is getting the stump jumper off. And I won't tell you why. The torque spec on bush hog for the stump jumper is either 1200 or 1800 foot pounds. That's just crazy. Get your nut off and everything else, and I'm telling you, now you get your torch out, you start heating up that crossbar on that stump jumper. Now you got an oil leak, so now you got a pretty good little fire going on with all the grass and the oil burning while you're up underneath this damn thing. Then you come out from underneath it, you can get you a 16 pound sledge. And I'm using the pen for the brush rake on my bulldozer and start whacking. And you gotta get some ump on it to pop that thing loose. And of course I missed a few times, so I got some nice dents in my deck. I ain't gonna sweat it. I did find out that this uh, bush hog I bought new. And we were trying to figure out what gearbox is on it, so I called the dealership so I got the right seals. Uh, this thing is 2004 model. So for a 16 year old bush hog, pretty dang good shape. That lower seal lasted 16 years, so I really can't complain. But this is by far my least favorite job on any kind of farm equipment repair. I'd almost want to get a tooth pull instead of doing this. But, got the hard part done, going back together, it ain't particularly easy either. That, that model stump jumper it's pushing 150 pounds. That son of a bitch is massive. Of course, I got my floor jack to help get it up. It's just seriously my least favorite farm repair job. But it's got to be done. So, you know, a whole lot going on. I want to check the end play in my gearbox output shaft, pop out the shield, pop out the seal. I think I can do it from underneath. I don't have to pull the gearbox. But I fought that stump jumper for a good 45 minutes to an hour, and it, it was a bear to get off. I had to get it pretty hot, swelled up, finally released, but it did. And I put the fire out, of course. But anyway, that's all for now. Thank you.